Yeah. yeah. I guess these, these are men's 13. Uh, what you got on these? Uh, 60. 60. Let's see what we got. Okay. I don't know what to go up on eBay. I didn't put them on eBay. I was going to put them on eBay. I'm eBay store. Looks like it's, there's some listed really high. There's only been one that sold in the last 90 days for 85. Yeah. What do you do? Buy storage units or something? I buy storage units in the States. Um, Everything. Sales, I buy whole yard sales. Yeah. So we often get comments from people saying that the shoes we buy at the flea market are fake or at least questionable. So I sent some pictures of this pair to an authenticity app called Check Check. So stay tuned to the end of the video and we'll see what they say. Oh, wow, it's a cool mag light hat. These fans. Mazda. I'm selling that whole lot, man. The whole table. What you want for it? 300. Hmm. 300 for the whole table. It's got some Xbox controllers. GameCube, but that's third party. Xbox One. I didn't see 300 there. What you got on this stuff? I got, uh... That's 10. That's 10. That core that's 10. The most they five each. Yeah, the Mazda and that, what's called it? Yeah, five. Mazda, five each, and we got... That's 20 for the Polo. 10 each on those. Yeah, I paid, I paid, I paid that price on, that's on the ticket for those, and I bought those. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, they're in that big bag right there. I'll do the 20 for the hats. I'll put this okay. back. These are cool, but I just don't think I can do 20 for the polo. We might be able to get like 30 for this, but that's just not worth not worth listing. Don't think I can do $10 for the course hat. Star Wars hat's kind of cool. I picked up those two exact hats. Just really? Why didn't, why didn't you get them? Well, I was, uh, I think this one's cool. But the that part's like come out. Oh, that's just like the backing to the embroidery. That's fun. What do you do? Buy storage units or something? I buy storage units in the States. Um, Everything. Sales, I buy whole yard sales. Yeah. All right. I think this is our pile here. I'll do 60 on those. Take a chance on those. 120. Okay. Yeah, 120. 60. 80. 95. I'll probably pass on the shirt. I just okay. noticed it's got a little hole right there. Okay, so it'd be... Just taking... That was, that was 15 so $100? $100, total? Yeah. Okay. I don't need bags. I'm we'll start, yeah, oh, okay. throwing the wagon right here. Thanks, man. Yeah, appreciate you. Yeah, I appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, this is a cool t-shirt guy. Mm-hmm. Oh, nice. Yeah, the bugs are terrible. Oh, modern, yeah. Wait for you not to well, I saw one. I saw one for the same costume. Yeah. But this well, it's one a mountain. Only the white one, you know? But it's a so bug. Oh, yeah. It's like a praying mantis or something. Yeah. That's awesome. Like, none of these are, like, super crazy, but they're all pretty good, you know? A Blockbuster t-shirt, Van Halen. Give me some of your tots and pull in down tonight. That one's awesome. Disneyland Goofy Bike Week. Godzilla Airborne. Tell me where she was. Float like a butter from Chicago Bulls. Blue Moon, my favorite beer. Coke. Oh yeah. Is that vintage? It's on a pro player tag, but Oh Titan Titanfall. That's awesome. Bucky's, Bucky's tie-dye. Zelda. Monsters Inc. Star Wars. Pulp fiction. Maybe. Alright, how much for all of them? <laughs> you can't count them though. You just gotta give me a number. <laughs> Alright, let's see. I'll start at six hundred dollars. Six hundred. Now I feel like I should count them. <laughs> and, and, and do the math to see it. There's a couple in there that are, that are pretty. Yeah, I saw like a Zion. What was it? That one's cool. Dale Jr. It's a little like ratty. Dale Jr. Yeah. Six hundred dollars for all of them, and I'll throw in the golf golf clubs and bag. It's a ping ping bag. Yeah. We just bought a ton of golf clubs recently. This is two thousand five Bob Marley. 
Rolling Stones, Mario Kart. Like, steal your. Isn't this that um, roller coaster that just broke? Yeah. That's ADH Dave's favorite roller coaster. If we buy all of them, we'll have to send that shirt to him. One, two, three, four, five, six, nine, six, 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 one, two, two, three, three, four, eight, four, five, five, nine, nine, six, nine, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, five, ninety. Should have said you can't count either. Should have. But you didn't. But I did. Looks looks about two hundred. So six hundred be like three bucks a piece. I won't I won't haggle you. I'll do six hundred. Can I keep the hangers? Yes. Yes, please. Six hundred dollars. They're yours. Six hundred. We'll take them. Like how many was it? I can about two hundred. I stopped at one ninety and there was like ten or fifteen okay, left. Okay, so it's about four dollars a piece. I guess. Three. Yeah, three bucks a piece. I can rent to the car. Yeah, I do. Yeah, here. Thank you. Where's the wagon? Uh, okay. That's three hundred. I'll give you the. I'll give you the other half when she comes back. Do you get these at like thrift stores, garage yeah, sales, or yard sales, thrift stores? Yeah. So you probably made some money. Made a little bit. And that I don't know if that's rented or not, but that's pretty good. I got some forty-one. This one's good. This one you need to put on eBay. Oh, nice. It's signed. Throwing cop signs. Yeah. Oh, look at there! Wow. Yeah, you need to put that. that one might be an eBay too. Oh yeah. Smack it down. That's cool. Are you organizing? Or no, I'm not organized at all. I'm just throwing them in there. Okay, we have a bag for an extra bag for a reason. I forgot about that. I'm I panicked. I'm sure we're gonna get people in the video that are telling me that I'm taking the hangers off wrong, but I'm too lazy to do it the right way. I should just give you my number, and you just be my T-shirt guy. Everyone you find, you just. Yeah, we, we do our, our whatnot shows. We're very blessed to yeah, have. If you can average, you know, like you said, seven to ten to seven to fifteen dollars a shirt. You'd yeah, be good. should probably pay you some more money now that I'm thinking about it. <laughs> How you doing over there? Oh, good. The wagon's very full. My bag is also full. All right, let me see if I got any more money for you. I have some. I feel bad. Give me another hundred dollars. I feel like that's fair. I want you to sell me more shirts in the future. Uh, so you, you already paid me three, so you're gonna give me. Oh yeah, you didn't give them anything else yet. No, I haven't. Given okay, them. give them four hundred then. And then you take the clubs. I'll take the clubs. I'll get those out of your way. I'll sell this nine iron. <laughs> it's still a fair price, man. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know, we gotta look out How for each other. Four hundred. Make sure that's four hundred. I guess it was worth your while to come out today. It was. It was. Hopefully the same for you. Thank you. Yeah, oh yeah. $700 richer. Yeah, man. <laughs> Thanks, man. We appreciate it. Hey, you want my number for, for real? All right, I'm giving you a call now. Uh, Hampton, South Carolina? That's me. And if you would, plug, plug my eBay store. What's your eBay store? It's Department 224. Department 224. All right, I'm recording that. All right, so if you got, you got stuff like this, but even better on your eBay store, right? Perfect. Everybody go check out Zebra Star. I'll have it linked in the description of this video. That's the least I can do for giving us the deal on the shirt. Hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. This is just a quick reminder to subscribe if you haven't already. So it's been a couple days since we left the flea market. We got all the t-shirts sorted, or should I say our helper Kim got all these sorted today, and we set up a whatnot auction with 30 random t-shirts. I just wanted to sell a couple of them just to get an idea of what we think they'll go for, and then we still have all these on the table that we are going to sell in a future whatnot show. Also, as a way to say thank you to the regular folks that come to our whatnot shows and allow us to do shows like this, we're actually gonna be doing a free giveaway only show in a couple of weeks, literally 100 items, everything's free, free shipping, all you gotta do is show up, hit the button to enter the giveaway and we're gonna give away something every 10 seconds. So it should be a really fun time, uh, but we gotta go ahead and jump into tonight's show. It starts at seven o'clock, I'm technically late we're going to jump in here and sell these 30 t-shirts and see what kind of money we get so it took us about 45 minutes to run that auction we did sell all 30 t-shirts and we made a total gross revenue of 359 dollars that's not uh after fees we still have to take out fees but that gives us an average selling price per shirt of 11 dollars 96 which is slightly more than i thought i figured we'd be around like eight to ten dollars but tonight went over really well i will say we had some cool shirts and i'm not sure i mean the rest of the shirts are definitely 
cool. I mean, we had a ton of Star Wars. We have this big mountain t-shirt with the big bug on it. I think that's really cool. A ton of Disney, some cartoon characters, some racing t-shirts, a lot of modern band t-shirts, a ton, I mean, a ton of Star Wars t-shirts. Luckily for us, those usually do pretty well. It's really cool Raiders t-shirt. Uh, it was on a pro player tag. I don't know if that's vintage, but I think that one would do pretty good. A modern liquid blue Grateful Dead shirt. I think we have three or four Bucky's t-shirts, some more band t-shirts, Cookie Monster, Tom and Jerry, just like super recognizable characters on these t-shirts. Is I think it'll be really easy for us to get, again, like eight to $15 per shirt. Tonight's show I thought went a little better than usual. Even if we can average $10 per shirt at 200 shirts, that's $2,000 from a $700 investment, which I think is very good, especially considering we're blessed enough to have whatnot so we don't have to actually list all this stuff individually and wait. 18 months for it to sell. We can sell everything very quickly. But again, we're not gonna sell anything else on whatnot until this video posts. Uh, and then the night that this video posts, the day that this video posts, we'll do another show of like 30 more shirts. Uh, and then we'll just keep doing those shows until we sell out. So check our whatnot link in the description of this video, bookmark our upcoming t-shirt shows. And again, bookmark that upcoming free show. 100 giveaways, 10 seconds, giving away an item. It's gonna be really fun. Definitely tune into that. So I did hear back from the folks over at Check Check about that pair of Nikes that we got in the beginning of this video. And I'll share that information with you in just a second. But if they are fake, if they are indeed fake, they will be worthless. We'll have lost $60 on those shoes, unfortunately. But if they are real, I think I'll probably end up listing them for like $150 to $180 plus shipping. There's four listed for sale on eBay right now, anywhere from like $80 up to $300. There's none in our size, a men's 13 but there's only one that sold on eBay in the last 90 days and that one sold for $85. So there's not a ton of information available, but it does seem to be a fairly rare shoe. It's a good color, a good good size, good condition. So I think $150 plus shipping would be a pretty fair price for that. I think worst case scenario, we could probably get $100 plus shipping. So that would pay for everything that we got from that guy at the flea market. And then we would still have all the hats and the Pokemon book and all the other stuff we, we bought from him. So moment of truth, are the shoes real? Are the shoes fake? According to Check Check, an authentication app that costs like three bucks to authenticate shoes, the answer is they're real. Look at there, they passed. I'm gonna list them on eBay for 150 bucks plus shipping and hopefully they'll sell pretty quick. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. We're the best. We'll catch you on the next one.